In this video, I'm gonna show you how to build an automated organic lead generation system. From taking comments on your personal profile post, automating all the replies to those comments, and moving those comment replies into an automated messaging sequence that allows you to generate new leads, drive new group growth, and do it all without any manual messaging. All right, so for those of you here that are using social media organically to grow their online business, chances are you are leveraging content to do so. Now, this content is there to obviously build no like trust, but also we were using content to move folks in our audience to that next step in the buyer's journey, whether it's moving them to become a lead, to join our Facebook community, to opt in to claim something, or simply to help drive conversations with what we're giving away or offering in our content itself and the call to action that we're providing at the end of those posts. Now, as you start to put up more posts, such as lead generation posts, that are built to generate comments of interest for that thing that you're selling or giving away, you may have run into an instance where you get a bunch of comments that are stacking up in that post. And when this happens, in my experience, it can be difficult to keep up with those comments, to reply to all of them, to message all of them, and it's very easy for opportunities to slip through the cracks. Leveraging this process that I'm about to share with you here today has been super helpful and time-saving for times, especially when I have a post that goes off and gets a bunch of comments and it's difficult for me to keep up with. This takes the weight off me having to do the manual work and instead allows me to leverage automation to take care of that work for me. So with that said, I'm gonna share my screen now and let's dive right into it. Scrolling down in this post, you can see here with the comments, replay, replay, asking for access to this free training that I offered. In the end of this comment here, I reply back, here's the link to check out the training with this link. Here's a link to check out the training, dropping the link to it directly. Now, I didn't take care of any of these comments manually. These were all automated. I'm gonna cover this towards the end of this video in terms of exactly how to set up and use this tool to automate comment replies and auto DM the folks that are showing interest on your content. But before we get into that, for those that want an inside look at where I'm sending them to, I'm gonna show you this here next. So this link that I'm sending people to is basically a ManyChat reference URL flow. Now, I'm not gonna get too deep into how to set up and create these flows as I have a previous video that I dropped on the channel breaking that down in detail. But the point is with many chat reference URL messaging flows, this is essentially where you can automate and build a messaging bot or sequence that connects from one message to another. So you can see here that this sequence begins with what's called a messenger reference URL. And when you go to create any bot inside ManyChat, a messenger reference URL is an option to begin with. What a reference URL does is it gives you a link to drive people to, to begin the messaging flow itself. So this link that we're seeing here on this post this is the beginning point of this automated flow. So once they click on that link and go to it to access the training, a few things are going to happen. The first thing is going to be they're gonna receive this first message. This first message is gonna say, hey name, are you looking for my recent training on five ways that I'm leveraging ChatGPT to maximize profits and performance in 2023? Giving them the option to say yes or no. So what I'm doing here to start is just basically confirming that this is what they were looking for and this is what they commented on beforehand. Once they click yes, the next step from here as you can see is now I asked them, okay, cool. Before I shoot over the link to the training, are you a member of my free Facebook community on Leaf CEOs? Yes, no, or I'm not sure. So the reason I'm asking this is because my ultimate goal from people commenting on this post is to move new leads and new group members into my free Facebook community. So the first thing I wanna do is confirm yes or no, are they a member of the group? Reason being is because also this training that I'm offering for free is actually held inside my group. So in order for them to access it, I first need to make sure, are they a member or are they not? Because if they're not a member, I'm gonna direct them to join that group first, capture that lead and get them in the group, and then deliver the training. If they are a member, I'll deliver the training to them directly and perhaps follow up with them after that point. So in this second message here, before I show over the link to the training, asking if they're a member, yes, no, I'm not sure. This is going to split into two options from here. If they say yes, it's going to say, thanks for letting me know. As an active member of the community, you can access the training directly at the link below. As you dive into the replay, if you want access to the slide deck, be sure to comment the keyword below as I offered that on the training itself. So I am bridging my established group members directly to the training so they can go and check this out right away. In the first iteration, if they said, no, I'm not a member of the community, this is going to say from here, got it. Since this training was held live inside of our community, the replay is available exclusively to active members. I'll shoot you over the direct link to the replay next, but before I do, be sure to join the group below. After you join, I'll get you approved ASAP so you can check it out. So here, I am directing them to join my free Facebook community on Lease CEOs. Again, for those of you here watching on YouTube that aren't yet a member of the group, link in the description below. Be sure to join us there. 
But in this example here, this is taking them directly to my Facebook group link. So my goal here is to get them to join the group first. Once they join, I'm gonna follow up and this flow is set up to send them a message 25 seconds later saying, once you join us inside, you can click the link below this message to go directly to the replay. And then same thing as you dive into it, if you wanna access the slide deck, go ahead and comment slide deck below and I'll send that over to you afterwards. And then this is direct them to the training. So this simple messaging flow for me is filtering out the people that aren't group members and that are group members of all those relevant interested comments on that post. And all the folks that aren't group members are going to be directed to join my group first and then get access to the training. And this is all allowing me to drive new group growth and new leads into my community and allowing me to follow up and nurture them from there. So to drive traffic to this flow, so this messaging can be taken care of for me. What I'm gonna do next is jump over to part two of this training. So as we jump back to the post here, imagine that this post originally had just all these comments of replay, 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 all the way down with no replies being made to them. So again, in this process, I'm using a conglomeration of two tools, ManyChat, which is an optional use. You guys can still do manual messaging here if you choose to. This for me is just allowing me to automate the follow-up, but to automate the comment replies and to spark the conversation, I'm doing this via automation using a tool called EL Messenger Pro. Now, EL Messenger Pro is the messenger CRM that I use to manage my six-figure business on Facebook. And I've done many videos on this before, and I'll throw one up here on the screen, including a walkthrough of how I use this tool as a CRM in my messenger. But this is one feature that I've never shared before that those of you here that have not seen this are gonna find it super powerful, super helpful, and a big time saver for your business. So what you can do is you open up this Chrome extension, EL Messenger Pro. So we're gonna open up the Chrome extension, EL Messenger Pro. As we have this opened up, we're going to go to back office. All right, so with the back office of EL Messenger Pro pulled up here, again, I'm gonna be going over to what's called the engage feature. And the engage feature is what allows us to automate comment replies on our Facebook post. So. With this pulled up here, the first step is going to ask us is number one, enter the tag name for people that replied with the keyword on your post. So what it means by this is again, jumping back over to this post, I had everybody that was interested in checking out this training comment the keyword replay below, and this will allow me to pinpoint and tell this tool who we want it to reply to based on the keyword that they commented. Now we're gonna get into that here in the next step, but the first step is they're just asking us to come up with the tag name for the people that it's replying to, to tag them in the CRM itself. So in this instance, I already have a tag set up for this. I'm just gonna use it AI training, since this training was around an AI, since this training was around AI in the giveaway that I did in the post itself. And then the keywords that I'm gonna have this automation tool search for is replay. So all I'm gonna do here is just type in hashtag replay, type it in in different variations, one with a capital letter, one with a lowercase letter. And once you, whatever variations you're typing in, you just hit enter after, and you can type in as many of these as you want. So depending on the keyword that you ask them to comment, put in different iterations of that keyword, and you can even go to the extent of even putting in some misspellings if you notice people misspelled it when they commented it. You can see here it actually just took away my lowercase comment, so no need to even note the uppercase or lowercase in the beginning because it picks up one or the other either way. But let's say I wanted to put in reply, R-E-P-L-Y, maybe somebody forgot to put in the A, this is gonna pick up and put in that keyword. Essentially whatever we put in here, me, test, whatever it is, this is what we're telling the tool, hey, look on this post and look in the comment section for these words. If yes, reply with this. So we're gonna leave this at these first two, replay and reply, and we're just gonna put next here. And now it's going to ask us the time frame that we want it to run for. So time, pause each five comments in interval from 20 to 25 seconds. I usually leave this set as what they recommend for the suggested settings here. Essentially, this is saying it's going to reply to five comments, wait 25 seconds, reply to five more, and continue to go through that process. That way, it's not looking on Facebook's end like we're using an automated sequence or an automated bot that's doing all these replies for us. This makes it look more human nature and natural. So now that we've set in the time frame, we've set the tag, all we gotta do from here is connect the post. So you can see here, I'm gonna come back to this post, and once I open it full screen here, I have a URL at the top. So I'm gonna grab this URL, which you may not see at the top of the video here, but it's just the post URL in the address bar. I'm gonna come back into this tool. And I'm going to drop this URL here and I'm gonna title the post. We'll call this five ways AI training. Here we can do a limit per day on how many requests or replies that it does. So if we wanna make sure that this tool only replies to 15 comments a day, it's going to come back to this post each and every day, scrub and look for new comments and ultimately follow through with this automation, but it won't go beyond the limit that we tell it to.
So we'll set it at 15 here. And now this is where we get to customize and set the automated follow-up message in the comments first. So this is where we can simply say, here is the link to the free training. Now two options here. If you wanted to do this in one way where you could just tag them and say, we're gonna comment back with their name, variables name. So this means it's gonna reply with their name first. Again, to show you what this looks like, if we scroll down here, you can see here it tagged this name in this post. So this is what we're putting in here. We're putting in the name and now I could do this one of two ways. I could say, just sent you a DM with access, hit next. And what I'm doing here is basically telling the tool whenever anybody comments this keyword, tag them their name in the comment reply and tell them just sent you a DM with access. Now we can have it send a direct message if we wanted to as well. What I did in this last post was I simply sent folks to this messenger bot in the comments. So I actually took here and I sent this for the comment reply. Here's the link to check out the training. We'll come back here. Here's the link to check out the training. And it's taking them right directly to this messenger reference URL link, which is taking them to that automated messaging flow. So as soon as they comment the keyword, it's replying back to them, tagging their name and directing them to this link to go into the automated messaging sequence, join the group, access the training and take care of that work for me. Again, you have two options here. If you don't wanna give the link in the description or in the comment section of your post, you could choose just let them know that you're sending them a DM with access. And as we go to the next part here and click next, you can click send a direct message and this is where you can actually DM them after it replies to the comment, it will send a Facebook message from your profile to them and you could say, hey, reaching out as I saw your comment on my post, looking for this training, here's a link to access it. So it's up to you whether you wanna do it as a DM message or do it as a comment reply. You can even do it as both if you wanted to. In the instance that I'm sharing with you to here today, since I use this automated messaging and follow-up flow, I simply direct them to this sequence via the comment reply itself. So we're just gonna not check direct message here and we're gonna click next. Pausing on this step and just highlighting, for those of you here that don't wanna get into the next step of automation and using and building out flows like this on ManyChat, by all means, you don't. You could start small and just use this tool to automate your comment replies and automatically reach out to them asking if this is the training they're looking for or to DM them the link to the training. This alone is a massive time saver and I'm sure everyone here that's using organic can see the benefit in that. So option is up to you on that, but you have the option to toggle on and off, send them a direct message. And you could even message everybody that didn't comment the keyword too, if you wanted to send a separate message to them, you can set it up to do so. Super cool that you can do that with this tool. Lastly, you're gonna choose from there what type of reaction you wanna drop on the post. So if you don't wanna to react to the post, and by reaction again, coming back to here, if I don't wanna put a love, I don't have to, I could leave it blank. But if I want this tool to come through and heart every comment that it replies to, I can tell it to heart, I can tell it to like and heart, I can tell it to do any of these emoji reactions. And I click add. Now once this is in, and once I have this all set up, we've got the tag, the keywords that we're wanting this automation tool to look for, time frame that we wanted to reply within, what post it's looking at, what it's saying in the comments, if it's sending them a message or not, and how it's reacting. Once all of this is set, all we simply have to do is click start and let the tool do the work for us and let it run through. And what it's going to do is going to pull up this post on our screen. It's going to scrub through this post and imagine if this were a comment here that said replay that wasn't replied to, it would find this comment it would like or heart the comment and it would reply back saying, here's the link to check out the training, just as it did here in this example. I just already ran this automation before making this video. So you won't see it happening live on the screen here, but this is essentially what it's gonna do is work through each and every comment, make sure it does exactly what you told the tool to do. And then from there, take care of that comment reply for you. And if you told it to, it will also take care of the automated DM to them as well. So what's cool about this too, in this example, EL Messenger Pro account that I have pulled up for this video, you can see here as I pull up the Chrome extension and open this up, it's gonna be a little bit small to see on screen, but as we open up this tool, we can click on engages and we can actually see all the posts that we have set up for this automation. So we can see here the five ways AI train that we just created. I can toggle on and off, start and pause this whenever I want. So if I'm waking up tomorrow and I wanna want this to run behind the scenes as I'm doing work, I can hit play on this. It's going to pick up what I already set up in this automation yesterday and continue to do the replies and the outreach for me. If more comments come in two days later, again, this tool will still be able to run behind the scenes and take care of these replies for us without us having to do the manual work. In closing here, I wanted to share this with you guys on the channel here today because I thought not only would you think it's something that's cool, but also something that's very helpful and time-saving for you and your business as it is for me. 
I know that although I don't do this on every single post when it comes to the sequence of both these automation tools, more than often if I'm putting up a post that I'm asking for a certain keyword of comment for interest or for claiming a certain thing that I'm giving away, I'm gonna be using that engage feature on EL Messenger Pro to make it so I don't have to reply to all those comments manually. The automation can take care of it for me. It can do the outreach for me and I can pick up the conversation from there. So in closing this video here, for those looking to learn more about how to use ManyChat and what I talked on here today and set up that automated messaging sequence, I'll go ahead and throw up that video here at the end of the screen. But for those looking for a more in-depth training on how I'm using my Messenger CRM, EL Messenger Pro, to manage my inbox, my multi six figure coaching business. I have another video linked here at the end walking through the CRM and particularly the inbox feature of tagging and organizing contacts in my inbox through this tool. Below this video, I'm gonna link the option to jump in and grab EL Messenger Pro again for those that wanna jump into it right away and start using this engage feature. And if not, you can go ahead and grab the free trial for EL Messenger Pro in the description below as well. With that aside, appreciate those of you here that have stuck to the end of this video and enjoyed this one. If you did enjoy it, be sure to smash that thumbs up button before you head out. And if you have not yet already, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go as well, so you're not missing out on any future videos that we drop on the channel as we do release new content here each and every week. Thanks again for watching, and I look forward to seeing you back on the next video very soon.